Hey everyone, it's Jenna from Celebrity Hotspot, and today I'm here at Camp Pulse with Nancy O'Mara. So what brings you out today? Have you been here before? I was. I was here, I wasn't here last year, but the year before, and it was mm-hmm. the first time that I met everybody here at uh, Camp Pulse two years ago. Mm-hmm. So are you teaching here? I'm teaching. I just had my first class. I started off the weekend, mm-hmm. and the talent here is really, really yeah. great. So like, what is like the goal of Camp Pulse? Like what? Like, what's it about? The goal, I think, for all of us as a faculty is to really inspire and motivate all of the kids and really get them to a place where they realize that having a great work ethic Mm -hmm. um, leads to self-esteem, self-respect, and Mm -hmm. teamwork with the other dancers. Mm -hmm. We want them to walk out of here and feel like they're 10 feet taller and that Mm -hmm. they can accomplish anything they want as long as they work hard at it. Mm So how did you get started in dancing? I grew up in Boston, and when I was nine years old, I saw the dance company from the studio that I trained at, which is the Gold Studios. Mm -hmm. And um, my mother signed me up, and I believe she told the secretary that I couldn't walk and chew gum, so maybe dance would be helpful. Mm -hmm. (laughs) So like, who have you choreographed for? Um, let's see. I'll go back. The first when I first started with some of the kids from Hollywood Records, affiliated mm-hmm. with Disney, was anywhere from Hilary Duff to Miley Cyrus mm-hmm. to gosh, uh, Bridget Mendler. Mm-hmm. Um, some of those, and then it goes over to singer songwriter like a Colby Calais and a Jason Mraz. And I just booked the John Legend tour, wow. so I'm really excited about that. I start mm-hmm. that on Sunday. As soon as I leave here, I'm going to go and meet him in Connecticut. Awesome. So what has been your favorite thing to dance like to or like choreograph? Gosh, my favorite thing to choreograph, I'm going to go, one of them was definitely Bone Dance on Hannah Montana. That was fun. So are you working on anything else besides the John Legend tour? Um, right now, well, I'm going to start back up with Colby Calais because she's working on her new album. I have two new artists. One's name is Rachel Taylor, and she is signed to Universal, and another girl whose name is Lindsay Sterling, mm-hmm. which I'm excited about because she's not a singer, but she yeah. plays the violin and she dances. Yeah. That's cool. So, like, what do you do when, like, you choreograph? Do you, like, do it for them? Like for like the music video? Yes, I I think that every artist is different. So once I get into the studio, I look at their body type, what looks good on them, Mm -hmm. depending upon what their music sounds like. And, um, you know, sort of like, basically it's like having a big blank piece of Mm -hmm. of clay and molding it so it fits for them. Do you actually, are you like actually in the music videos or you just choreograph? Not anymore. I decided that I wanted to be on the other side. a couple years ago it's just easier you know I used to you know I mean my first uh, one of my first dance jobs was I did got to do Paula Abdul's tour yeah so I started with that and then eventually I just decided I wanted to be on the other side Mm -hmm. so like who are your inspirations my inspirations are David Moore and Lane Knapper who are here I just adore them I love working with them and let's see my other inspirations I'm a big Prince fan I'd have to Mm -hmm. say Prince and I guess I could say anybody that I feel like really works hard and succeeds at what they do. Is there anyone you want to work with that you haven't yet? I would love to work with Shakira. <laughs> That'd be awesome. So what are your social media accounts? Um, my Facebook. I have my Facebook page. I have my Twitter, which is N Omera. I have Facebook, I have Twitter, I have Instagram, and they're all under N Omera. Great. Thank you so much.